I guess what we've really learned is that the student media is the local media. Student reporters for Blair High School's independently run newspaper Silver Chips have been actively following the coronavirus beat. Every hour we're, we're making sure we're updated, uh, making sure if there's any breaking news to report, we send that out as quickly as possible. Silver Chips has 80 staff members, which include reporters, photographers, a puzzle editor, and more. You've moved to online learning. How has that changed the way that you're operating as, as a news organization at the school? We're facing some, some problems on the other hand, because our printer is obviously not an essential business and therefore our printer is closed. We're reshaping our website, silverchips.org, so that we can add stories onto that. So in the meantime, we're transitioning to an online publication. Silver Chips reporters have been covering breaking news. They closely follow Governor Hogan's coronavirus press briefings. I mean, I've learned a ton. I have to be correct, and I have to be correct immediately. On Twitter, Silver Chips breaks down COVID-19 data using explanatory graphics. They also share helpful videos about how to make homemade face masks. We always aim to tailor our reporting to our audience, which for the most part is students. Silver Chips is a class at Blair. Now that students are getting settled into online learning, the Silver Chips reporters are adjusting to telling even more stories exclusively for the web. And I know every single one of us wants our stories to get out there, wants to make an impact. Reporting for MyMC Media, I'm Deirdre Byrne.